Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To contribute to a group that you are a member of, click the name of the group in the groups list. The groups list can be found in the mail, calendar, and people apps on the left side of the page. When you have clicked the name of the group, the group inbox will be displayed in the center of the page. The group reading pane will open on the right side of the page. This basic setup is similar to the mail app main page. The first time you visit the group, a welcome to the group name, where group name is the name of your group, email will be in the inbox and viewable in the reading pane. The email contains links to start a conversation, view group files, and use the calendar. Clicking the Start a Conversation link in the Welcome message will open a pop-up window for you to create a new conversation email for the group. You will create a new conversation just as you would a regular email. When creating a group conversation, the whole group is automatically entered into the to line of the message via the group email address. Whenever you create a group, a group email address is created that will send the same email or conversation to all group members. The entire history of group conversations are preserved until they are manually deleted. This is helpful if a new member joins the group as they will have access to all the prior conversations and can easily catch up. So you'll enter a subject line and then the body of the email and you can do any formatting as you normally would and then click send to send the email or discard to discard the email. You can also start a group conversation by clicking the start a group conversation link in the inbox pane. This will open a small pane similar to a chat window where you will start a conversation. Type your message into the text box and click send to send the conversation to the group. You can insert attachments by clicking the paperclip icon, which is the attach link, where you will choose the file to attach. Clicking the picture icon will allow you to insert a picture into the conversation. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.